Hi, I'm Michael Anderson, and I'd like to share with you a story. It's actually a very sad story of something that just happened. One of my clients uh, unexpectedly passed away, and it was someone who I'd known for many years. And when I learned of this, I was, I was very sad. Um, it was a really terrific person. But when it comes to financial planning, it's important to understand the financial aspects of death. Now, sometimes when someone passes away, there's a life insurance policy which can provide some financial resources for the family. But in many cases, for people in retirement, the life insurance is a thing of the past. But when someone passes away, if they're married, the survivor typically keeps the larger of the two Social Security checks. The smaller one typically goes away. And oftentimes, if there is any pension income, there's oftentimes a reduction. Now, I've seen many times, unfortunately, where people pass away, but they haven't done adequate financial planning in the event that that happens. So a very important part of financial planning is making sure there are adequate financial resources, both when you're alive and, of course, for your loved ones after you pass away. Now, this is something that you should probably engage the help of a fiduciary advisor versus a product salesman, so you have someone acting in your best interest and working alongside you as part of this planning process. Money Insider is sponsored by Anderson Wealth Management.